Hello there. Welcome. My name is Calliope and I'm going to be performing your hearing examination today. How are you doing today? Okay. Well, I hope by the time you leave our hearing examination, you have a little bit better idea of what's going on and we can have a treatment plan just waiting in the wings for you, okay? All right. Would you mind just confirming your name and date of birth for me? Okay. Here we go. And what is your preferred name and how do you like to be addressed? seeing you here for hearing loss, but I would like to hear from your own words what exactly we are seeing you for, what you've been referred to here for, okay? All right. Mm-hmm. And approximately when did you start noticing that you were having an issue? Okay. All right, and that's when you had gone to get that ear examination, correct? Okay. All right. So... I've got a few preliminary questions for you before we really get into the hearing loss and asking about that. So, do you have any current pain or any current illness at all? Excellent. And any changes to the medical history? I think we've got a pretty complete one here. Okay. And what about your family history? Any changes to that? Okay. And any changes to your allergies? Okay. And what about your medication list? That's all updated. Okay. Very good. All right. So now I'm going to be asking you quite a few different questions regarding your ears and your hearing, okay? And after that, we'll get into our testing. So, firstly, do you have any ear pain, whether currently or during the history of this issue? Have you had any trouble with ear pain? Okay. And any history of ear infections, including perhaps when you were a child? All right, and any itching or swelling discharge from the ears? Okay, very good. And difficulty hearing, of course, that's what we're seeing you for, so I'm just going to jot that down. Okay, and is the difficulty more in one ear, the other, or both? Very good. All right. Are you having difficulty understanding speech or do you really have to think about what someone has said? Or perhaps do you have to ask someone to repeat what they've said? Okay. Good. All right. Do you have difficulty listening and understanding what's being spoken over the phone. Okay, very good. And do you have an easier time in person or over the phone? Okay. I've been relying on 
on lips and, and cues, right? Context. Do you have difficulty with focusing on, for example, someone speaking if there is background noise? Right, like if you're in a busy area or perhaps if you have the radio on, if someone else is speaking, any difficulty with that? Do you spend a lot of time in noisy areas, in general? Do you often wear headphones or earphones? Okay, and do you generally keep the volume higher or do you only put it at the lowest you can go while still understanding? All right. Do you attend concerts at all? Okay. Yeah, that sudden blast of of loud noise can often give temporary hearing loss and the more you go, obviously, the more you're at risk for losing it significantly. Are you close to construction at all? Whether you work with it or if it's around your area, any construction. Okay, and what about machinery? Are you around machinery at all, heavy machinery? Even loud vehicles like trains. Okay, yes, as I say that, we've had a couple of trains in the background, huh? And are there certain sounds that are more difficult to hear for you than others? For example, higher pitch sounds, lower pitch sounds, whether it's difficulty hearing a high soprano voice versus a low baritone, anything ringing a bell there? All right, very good. So that's all the questions I have for you. So now we're going to be performing quite a few different tests in order to accurately assess what exactly is going on with your hearing, what kind of hearing loss you have, and that'll give us more information about how we can help you later on, okay? So we're going to be testing your ability to hear high and low frequencies, distinguishing left from right. We're going to have different volumes. We'll have a little bit of understanding and repeating back. And also we're going to be testing your ability to listen despite background noise, okay? So let's get you all fitted out with your headphones. So these are a Bluetooth pair, so we don't have to deal with any pesky cords, right? And it is adjustable here. And the cushioning for your ears is very comfortable. It shouldn't put any unpleasant pressure on your head or your ears, okay? If at any point, for any reason at all, you experience any pain or discomfort, please let me know. We can get these off, okay? I'm just going to be placing these onto your ears, okay? And then it'll be a little difficult to hear me. I have a little clicker here that I'm going to be using to start and stop the sounds, okay? And from time to time, I'll just be writing down your results 
over here, okay? Is the fit comfortable for you? Okay, no pain, no unpleasant pressure. Okay, very good. So let's see here. We're gonna start with the high and low frequency testing. What I want you to do is when you hear one of the sounds, one of the tones, you can either raise your hand or you can say yes, okay? That's all you have to do. So, I'm gonna go ahead and start the test. So that tested the high and low frequencies that you may or may not be able to hear. Our next test is going to involve you distinguishing left or right, or there may be some sounds that are bilateral, hear them on both sides, okay? So during this part, you can either raise your left or your right hand to distinguish, and if there are both, then
then you can raise both hands. You can also verbalize either left, right, or both if you'd like. The choice is up to you, okay? Are you ready to begin? Right. So that concludes the second test. Now we're going to be moving on to a test that will involve the sound increasing in volume. So at first it will be very soft, very subtle. Most likely you won't be able to hear it. As soon as you're able to hear it, I want you to either raise your hand or say, Yes. Okay? All right. So, you ready? Okay. Okay. Good.
good. Very good. Okay. So we are halfway done with the test, okay? We've got three separate parts left to go. So now we're going to test when you stop hearing a sound. With our previous test, we had the sound increasing in volume. This time our sound will decrease in volume. And when you stop being able to hear the sound, I want you to either raise your hand or say yes, okay? All right, doing okay so far? Okay, just wanna make sure. So let's get that started. You ready to go? Okay.
right? So we're going to move on to our next test and through the headphones you should hear a word being spoken. What I want you to do is when you hear that word, I want you to repeat it back to me, okay? Alright, ready to go? Okay. Green. Melt. Plant. Blizzard. Careful. Scrape. Fall. Purple. Weather. Queen. Hobbit Lily Yellow Good. All right. So, last test, okay? This is going to be just a little bit longer than the last couple of tests. So, this time, we're going to have you 
do the same as the previous test. I'll have you repeat the word that you hear when you hear it. This time there's going to be background noise that is also playing at the same time. I want you to do your best to understand and repeat the word back to me, okay? All right, ready to go? Okay. Random. Violin. Memory. Collection. Dreadful. Oak and we'll switch forest young Repel Sturdy Passion. Stately. Verdant. Hawthorne Smuggle Open Thank you. 
sensory. Go ahead and take off your headphones, okay? Here we go. Very good. Okay, so how are you feeling? Do you think you did all right? Okay, so were there any parts of the test that you felt were more difficult than the others? Okay. All right. Yeah, I thought so. Okay. And any other concerns at all? Anything else that was more difficult? Okay. Very good. Any other notes at all? Okay, very good. So, what we're going to do from here is I'm going to assess your results. I will get in contact with your ear doctor. We'll come up with a little plan and some different options that we can move forward with to help you with this issue, okay? If you have any questions for me at all about the test, about your results, you can always give the office a call, okay? It's no problem at all. Otherwise, I imagine you'll hear from us within two or three business days, okay? All right, anything else before we go? All right. Well, thank you so much for coming here to the audiology clinic. Really appreciate having you here. I hope you have a whale of a day and a good rest of your night. Thank you.